Okay, I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Thanks, Ryder. That should be enough. I'll analyze this and let you know what I find. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Hey, I recognize your insignia. Your Nexus, right? A Pathfinder. Kent Halsey, Nexus Security. Didn't know your duties reached all the way to Elodin. It doesn't. I'm here for... <sighs> personal reasons. My sister Isabel fell in with the wrong people. She joined the Rebellion and was exiled to Kadara. Somehow, she pissed off enough people to end up in this hellhole. Your security and your sister's a troublemaker. Puts you in an awkward situation. I don't care about that. I'm here to find her. I know she can't come back to the Nexus. But we can start over on Kadara. Together. You'd give up your life for her? Izzy's the only family I have. I'd do anything for her. The problem is... I underestimated this planet. I don't have a vehicle or a way to survive the heat. I'm stuck before I've even started. Don't worry. I can track Isabel down for you. I hoped you'd say that. I think the Salvager from Kadara has info on her. She wouldn't give me anything, but maybe you can get her talking. Look at you. I'm good at reading people. Want me to guess who you are? Shoot. A Pathfinder. How'd you know? I cheated. I run salvage to Kadara. Word travels fast there. Should hear what the Collective is saying about you. Well, now I'm curious. I won't repeat it, for your sake. What's your take on Elodin? If the worm or the gang leaders don't kill you, the heat in Ataraxia will. I don't know how anyone can live here. Somehow they make it work. Barely. At least once a trip, an escaped slave or ex-cultist tries to bribe me for a ride out of here. Except the Krogan. I've seen New Tachanka. We'd all be lucky to have a setup like theirs. You said you run salvage to Kadara. How does that work? The scavengers come from Hell's Promise to sell me their scraps. I pay them next to nothing. Charming. Then what? I haul my loot to Kadara and sell to the merchants. Sloane takes her cut, naturally, but mostly I make a killing. Sometimes I even buy water from Aenea and sell it at a premium in the flop house. 
It's a solid life. If you say so. You must deal with the scavengers a lot. No more than I have to. Slavery, cannibalism, gang leader worship. It's enough to make my skin crawl. I plan to keep my distance. Smart. But it's not just the gang leaders. The ones in the Paradise are dangerous, too. This is supposed to be a neutral zone. But I don't trust the scavengers to follow the rules. Got info on someone named Isabel Halsey? What am I? Your personal database? Come on. You're the only one here who doesn't want to kill me. Just help me out. Fine, fine. I I've never met her, but I heard a few scavengers talking. Mention a cave out in the dunes. Something about Isabel's time being limited. This is the nav point. Just watch out. That's a bad area. All of Elodin is a bad area. Good point. Ever worked with a guy named Reyes? Reyes? He's one of my buyers, actually. You know him? We've met. I'm not surprised. Reyes knows everyone. Some a little too well. Take it easy. Always do. Scavengers set up camp out here. How do they survive the heat? Heads up, looks like a scavenger dump site.
Pathfinder. I detect broken scavenger machinery ahead. Activating automated forward station deployment. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Pathfinder, we're approaching a scavenger site. I advise caution. I detect multiple hostile life forms. Isabel could be in trouble. Let's move. 